hello viewers welcome to go freelance tutorial today i'm going to show you uh, how to do the left uh, join with the link queue in a c-sharp uh, program so i, I think aware that our channel is completely uh, uh, like 60 70 percentage covering the c-sharp.net languages so uh, here i have a list it's uh, strongly typed uh, so uh, one list called a book list and one is the order okay so uh, uh, with a strongly typed so I defined a class uh, book and order with the uh, properties so uh, here I have a uh, one static uh, uh, not a dynamic but uh, I, I hard coded the list data here a list b book list with the book names and the order so this is the order six orders uh, for the book uh, with referring with the book ID and the payment mode is uh, this so uh, I want such a result that I need to left join so which book uh, uh, if suppose this is uh, devcurry.com uh, developers so this uh, motivational uh, gurus uh, spiritual uh, gurus uh, so uh, 5 on jquery aspirant recipes so these are all the books uh, and uh, this books uh, 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 purchased in my uh, 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 website so uh, so this is what the payment mode happened so uh, for the how to uh, so these are all the uh, booking uh, book id so uh, book id actually devkari uh, purchased by uh, uh, check and uh, the cash check uh, by cash two types and dot not curry uh, there is a uh, no uh, payment is done for this and the third book uh, fourth and fifth so that is what uh, all about so all the book types uh, uh, I'm just uh, mm, showing uh, uh, but uh, which are all the books that have a payment uh, done so that will be replicated so that is what the logic behind it let's go and uh, do some operation over here okay let me go and write my uh, link queue query uh, to make that uh, uh, left join works so how to uh, do the left join so left uh, normally uh, what it is actually uh, the right side of uh, the list it is mean this is the my uh, list so it will be remain same and it will go and join with uh, my book list uh, so uh, matched uh, book id so if uh, it uh, that uh, join have multiple yes it will display multiple times so that is what the logic behind so let's go and write it okay where order books okay so let's go and write the link queue book in book list join or dr order in book order on book dot book id so uh, uh, we are going to join with the book id equals copy order dot book id into result one okay so uh, what i did is i just uh, joined uh, this um, mm, uh, from book list to uh, order equals to book order ID and that uh, join I push into the result okay so now uh, even uh, if order is empty also I need to show that uh, uh, book list so for that what I need to write uh, so I I going to write one condition okay this is a final okay something like uh, final result okay select from in result one okay select default if empty okay by using such a condition default if empty uh, which uh, actually uh, uh, if uh, default empty just uh, place the new order uh, it means like empty order okay and finally select the value select 
new okay what are the things you need to select one is uh, book uh, dot book dot book id then book name book dot book name then then let's uh, take the order id as well okay order order dot order id okay it is uh, there in the result okay already we pushed that into the result one and that we pushed already into the final result so final result dot order id and final result dot payment mode okay okay our uh, left join is done then finally i will go and dump this uh, to display the records dot dump okay i am using the link pad to show you this demo okay let's go and execute now so I have a book uh, id book and order id 1 3 and the payment mode is uh, check cash and second book uh, no one is uh, purchased there is no order id it is displaying zero and the payment mode is null yes it is because uh, uh, it is empty and the third book uh, only one time and uh, the order id is uh, four and uh, the payment mode is uh, check so uh, so likewise you can do the left join and if you left join if you do uh, you you feel that yes if default if empty uh, please accept that and uh, default uh, empty uh, just to show that it, it will uh, display the null with the uh, left join so this is the way to achieve that hopes you understand uh, so what i uh, did is uh, so this already i have a list to list uh, with the pre-filled uh, data so this is uh, just a hard coded value so this is all strongly typed one is a book list and one is order list so once i uh, book uh, uh, the order so it will generate me the order id and which book and the payment mode so these are all the uh, strongly typed class that is declared then i uh, went and uh, uh, do the left join for that uh, mm, I, I took the uh, list one this is the right uh, and this is left so uh, I joined uh, uh, with the uh, order uh, with the uh, book ID matched and that result I pushed to the result one and even I need the uh, if uh, suppose that book is not even purchased also I need to show that it is a null so that is why I write written condition from in the result one default if empty uh, then it will be a, uh, considered as a new order uh, so new order uh, such that there is a empty result there is no result holding on that just push uh, the zero value so that will uh, hold us so if uh, if uh, give the new order it will create the empty uh, um, uh, data for that object so uh, anyways uh, uh, default uh, integer zero and uh, the payment mode even string uh, it's null so that is what it's displayed like that so so this is what the result we got hopes you understand thanks for watching the video guys if you have any doubt queries please comment us uh, please share the tutorial if you like the tutorial uh, please subscribe our channel if you want to get a more updates like this